So this video I didn't record an intro or an outro to. So the first part of this video takes place on a slough on the Wisconsin River. And it was about 40 degrees that day and cloudy out. And I think I had four flags on tip-ups and four automatic, four ice fishing quick sets go off, which I was trying to do a review on the ice fishing quick set, which will be my next video. And I caught one pike on a tip-up and one pike on the ice fishing quick set, which the footage from the ice fishing quick set did not turn out well. And then that later part of this video was filmed the day before, and this was on so the Madison chain in a bay, and we had like five flags while well, I was there, and we caught three pike, and the biggest was like 27, 28 inches, the pike at the end of the video that there's a picture of. And we were fishing with medium and large shiners about two to three feet below the ice in both these videos, and the first slew ranged from about three to six feet of water, and the other bay we were fishing was about six to eight feet of water. So here's the video. We literally just set up our tippets and we got a flag. Oh, it's spinning too. We missed it. Caught a pike. A snap rocket or hammer handle. Yes, we caught a fishy. Second time this flag has went up. And this is a floppy little guy. Move much. Hmm. Yeah, this. <laughs> oh, that fucker was on there. Was he really? Yeah, motherfucker was on there. <laughs> he barely. He didn't, he didn't even have this. Probably a 16 incher. <laughs> oh, Ooh, that's a good one. Run. Well, I think this is a solid fish. <laughs> it's a fighter. That's like a miler. That's like a girl that looks like a 10 from 100 yards away and then she comes <laughs> up and she's a tool. <laughs> when they flash down there, it always gets me going. Like once in a while, like sometimes a bluegill will come in and it'll just nail your jig and you pull it up and it's a 6 incher and you think it's like an 8 incher by how it hit. I haven't had a single flag yet. That's a monster. Let's make sure. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's a monster. Boom, baby. You don't think it took any line out? I, it's, it's going that way pretty good actually, but so was his and he just put it back down and 10 minutes later it went up and that fish was down. Huh. You brought the middle. That is the problem. Yeah.
This fish is like the one that's yeah. sneaking up on us a little bigger than I thought. It's a musky. This is a nice pack. Sure. This one might be. The one we've caught today. Oh, it just swallowed it too. Sure. I think we might as well cut the line on this one. Cutter. Unless one of us, it's just completely swallowed. We can probably oh. keep this one if one of us wants to keep it. I'm good. I'll, I'll take it. If My shoutouts for this video go to the Bass's Fat and Fly Tying and Fishing. Their links will be in the description for this video. Thanks for watching this episode of Muskie Hands Outdoors and please subscribe to my channel.